what character you are based on your zodiac. Part 1. I don't really talk like this, I know. But this nigga got a real big whoop for show. Said he wanna take it to the room, let's go. He ain't got a La tía de, de una italiana que está buenísima. ¿Cómo va a estar tu hija, eh? Hey Eliza. What? Do you remember the day you were born? No, but I remember when the, the earth would open and We live in cities you'll never see on screen Not very pretty, but we sure know how to run You want to bamba? You wanna G with the big boy? Now you the wrong kitty kitty, you the wrong get a get a coffee drink, but a drop cup. Ha! Hey! Can you see how the thing goes? How the thing goes? Why you tell me who blends you? Heaven off. Pull the trick nine. The bitches want fine. Step in my line. Now break the end the game. End the game. What I'm smoking on. Like what you tripping on. Fuck the chase. I'ma keep it real and bust up all the snakes. Here are the zodiac signs as different types of kids. Scorpio, you 100% ate glue and crayons. Aries, you were the playground bully. Menace to society and jungle gyms everywhere. The majestic Taurus. Pretty sure you drooled all over yourself during nap time. And nap time was all the time. 
Answer, I would say I'm surprised, but you 100% cried during The Lion King. And like, an ugly cry. Gemini, you definitely had a fish as a pet, and by a fish I mean multiple, because you killed them all. For some reason, Sagittarius always had the cool folders. I promise you, I tried to steal them. As a Capricorn, yes, I was a know-it-all and a teacher's pet. It's not because we want to be, it's because we're smarter than all of you and know how to finesse our grades. Libra, I'm gonna say it, you only had friends because you had the best snacks and you shared them. Virgo, this you? I can't explain it, but these scream Virgo children. Leo, glad headbands and nice outfits, and bossy. Aquarius, I'm pretty sure you were obsessed with Pokemon. Pisces, your best friends were animals, and you swore you could talk to them. astrologer of 10 years and I have my own chart reading business so your opinions are fine just know that I know my shit okay nerds only this is fucking lord of the rings as the zodiac signs I'm not laughing because he's a cancer I'm laughing because <laughs> Sauron is an Aquarius because we just think we're helping everyone but we're really not this beautiful mythical creature is a Leo one does not just simply be an Aries in a movie they fucking crush it. One's a Pisces, one's a Sag, I don't know which, just make up your own minds, okay? You won't believe it. He's a Virgo. I promise. This pussy ass bitch is a Libra. The positive side of a Taurus. God, he's beautiful. <laughs> Gemini. Yeah, Gemini. The reason I'm a sucker for Capricorns? <laughs> Christmas is right around the corner, so here's a ranking of the zodiac signs based on who's been the nicest and who's been the naughtiest this year. Controversial, but bottom of the pack, it's going to be Capricorn, Virgo, and Taurus. Um, you guys can be mean sometimes, but naughty is more about like rule breaking, and you guys don't do that, so that's why you're at the bottom of the list. After that, it's going to be the other fixed signs, so Aquarius, Scorpio, and Leo. Listen, you guys don't like to take risks, and naughty bitches take risks and do things that are rebellious and evil. Um, you guys, again, can be mean, but, you know, you're just not naughty. Next is going to be Cancer and Libra, strictly because they'll, like, dabble in the dark arts of being naughty, but they won't really, really fully commit as the other signs do. Next, it's going to be Pisces and Gemini. Let's be honest. We all know that Pisces and Gemini are super freaks and very naughty and just doing things that always get them into trouble. And the top two, Sagittarius and Aries. Naughty, naughty, naughty. You are not getting anything you want from Santa this year. 